That was a nasty fall. How do you feel right now? Yeah, um, I banged my shoulder up a little bit, but, you know, it'll be fine. Just go get some treatment. We got the best trainers in the world, so I'll be good. And despite the loss, how did you feel having back-to-back -back strong games for the team? Um, it felt good, you know, just a good confidence boost, just knowing I can go out there and produce for my team. Um, so, you know, my name was called, and I just, I produced. What was the moment like for you when you hit the three and the whole bench ex exploded the way they did? I felt good. Um, you know, I think on my first three I hit, so everybody was excited, and, you know, my adrenaline and everything just took over. It's not like you were playing in, in garbage time. You were playing, like, real minutes for this team. Like, what does it mean for you to not just have that happen once but two times in a row and be able to kind of, like, leave your mark on, on games like that? And I mean, it's big. You know, Philly, especially Philly, you know, they're, they're a solid team. Milwaukee's a solid team. So me going out there and producing, I, I think it's just showing everybody and me showing myself that, you know, I can play against, play on, at, at the highest level. How gassed were you in the first half? I was tired, man. I think, I think just... It was it was just a combination of me just you know giving it my all and my my emotions running high so I just needed to calm myself down. Did you hit your head at all when you fell? It looks like you hit the right side of your face. Yeah, I mean I hit my head a little bit, but it was more, more so my shoulder. My shoulder really took the blow, so you know that's a good thing.